What's up, everybody? It's Nia back with more Petty Awards to give out. Now, I know you've heard. These guys all have something in common. They're petty. Welcome to the R&B edition of the Petty Awards. R. Kelly can't get it right. He dates younger women and gets in trouble. Then he dates someone over 18 and he still gets in trouble. He's being accused of having a sex cult in his homes. His girlfriend made a video statement first saying that it's not true and Kells officially just said it wasn't true in time for his ticket sales since he had a concert. Since R. Kelly took so long to respond, it's pretty clear. That's petty. This hurt my heart. I can't listen to a Usher song no mo. Allegedly, Usher out here giving herpes to people and he knew he had it and he didn't tell him. So this lady showed some documents to Raider Online proving that Usher did pay $1.1 million to settle for exposing this woman to herpes, allegedly. Then another woman came forward and said she slept with the artist this year and she too tested positive for the virus. But she's suing for $20 million. Man, Usher, if this is true, ah, this last one involves uh, Bobby Valentino as he was um, having some uh, intimate time with a paid male escort. And when he didn't pay, the escort recorded Bobby Valentino with his pants off, forcing him to run out of the hotel room covering his face. Two things here. One, why didn't the escort get paid first? And two, really Bobby? Pay somebody for the job that you hired him for. And I'm just playing, you petty. Like all the women that you sang to, you couldn't have got with one of them. That's it for this R&B edition of the Petty Awards. Peace and pettiness, bye.